Hello and welcome to this episode of J-Man Train. It's Monday night, so well, normally on a Monday, what do I do? I've decided last couple of weeks I'm going to go for a long bike ride and then I'm going to go for a run afterwards. I'm actually doing a bike ride with my brother who's in the background there. You can see he's just there. It's the first time we've been out, so he's not been on a bike for quite a long time, so I decided to give him my bike and then I'm cycling on a very, very old mountain bike. Let me show you the bike that I've been cycling on uh, and then you can work out if it's any good or not. So. Uh, the bike that I've been cycling on is this bike here. It's actually quite light. Uh, it's, it's, uh, it's quite a light bike and it moves pretty well, but because my uh, young brother isn't as good at cycling, I thought I'd give him the, uh, the better bike and I'm cycling on the bike. Gotta be honest, the last time I was out on this bike was probably when I did a triathlon two years ago. Um, this is the bike here. I'm actually not gonna give you a close-up inspection because it's rusty and my fault I let it fall apart but what we've done is we've cycled from my house over to Manchester Trafford Centre it's about 10 kilometers it's taken approximately 38 minutes as per the Strava app which I'm on you can follow me on Strava just search um, I'll tell you what to search find out but we've come over here to Trafford Centre you can see the fountain just there in the background and just above me there's Selfridges just there so I'll let you see uh, the rest of the journey I've done my cycle ride now, so uh, I'm quite happy I reckon. I look at my phone in a bit, I'm front screen. I've done approximately 20 kilometers and I'm gonna park my bike and I'm gonna go for, uh, I'm gonna go for my run. I am tired, but we're nearly home now. Last little bit. Okay, so I've done my cycle, I'm knackered. All I've done is go home, Drop my bike off at home and I've semi-jogged to the uh, to the local park. I'm now going to go and run um, at least 5k, if not more, purely because on the day, that's what I'm going to do. I'm about 30 minutes into the run. I've done just over two and a half kilometers, something like that. I've got a stitch. It won't go away. It just won't go away. I can't run through it. Anyway, I'm having a 15 second walk back to it. I'll keep you updated. What a beautiful sky. A bit of red in the background, the camera's not doing it justice. Hello. How are you doing everybody? Is everybody okay? So this is the uh, the end of J-Man Train video, vlog. I've done my, uh, my cycle. I've done my run, I'm gonna talk a little bit about my run. The first five minutes of my run was tough. I've gotta be honest, all it was, it was just mind over matter. My legs had nothing at all whatsoever. Um, however, after five minutes, I found my rhythm a little bit. Um, and after 10 minutes, again, I think it was about 30 minutes, 40 minutes, I had a stitch. There was no way I was gonna stop. I had to keep walking pretty fast. Uh, for about 15 seconds, I carried on. I, uh, I got through the stitch, came out the other end, and by my stopwatch, I reckon I did just short of 40 minutes. Uh, but I'm going to put up on the screen here what I did on uh, on Strava, so you can you can follow me on Strava. So I did the uh, did the run afterwards. It was tired as hell, but I'm pretty happy with what I did. Um, I've got exactly I've got exactly um, 14 days, so seven days of training. The last week I'm just going to do 60%. So sort of relax. Okay, so uh, I'll see you in the next episode of J Man Train. High five. Okay, so what have I actually learned today? The single most important thing that I've learned is mind over matter. My body will do what my mind tells it. Sometimes when you're running, you look in the distance, you think, right, I'm gonna stop at that point, at, at a pillar, at a chair, at a row. If you tell your mind just to go beyond that point, it does it. So why can't you tell your mind just to carry on running? Today, I did just that. My legs wanted to give up, bang, no, your mind, come on, keep on going, keep on going. If you're gonna make it, you've gotta push it and push it and push it, and it works. That's what I learned today. If you take one thing away from it, take that.